Hey guys, welcome back to another interesting topic. So today we are going to solve a tricky question. So before we go to the question, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn your notification on. And if you have any doubts, comment down below, I'll respond within 24 hours. So the question is, design a circuit that receives a single digit, coded BCD and gives an output result multiplied by phi BCD coded with minimum logic. So if you give an BCD coded input, the design gives you BCD coded output which is multiplied by phi of input. But the main point is with minimum logic. So let's represent the question in tabular form. In this table, we have input and output. According to the question, the input receives a single digit. In decimal, it is from 0 to 9. And in BCD, each decimal digit is represented by a 4-bit binary with positional weights of 8, 4, 2, 1. So A3 will have positional weight as 8 and 4, 2, 1 for A2, A1 and A0. So if we take 1, in BCD, we are going to represent it as 0, 0, 0, 1. And similarly for others. So as mentioned in the question, if we give the input to the design, we are going to get the output multiplied by 5. So if we give 1, we are going to get 5, 2, 10, 3, 15. So we got our outputs multiplied by 5 and they are represented in BCD. So in BCD, each digit is represented by a 4-bit binary. So we have 8 bits as output, B3, B2, B1, B0, and C3, C2, C1, and C0. So if 20 is the output in BCD, we are going to represent it as 0, 0, 1, 0 for 2 and 0, 0, 0 for 0. So this is a question. Uh, you can use KMAP to solve it or any other method you know. So please try to solve it without looking into the solution first. Please give your best efforts. A hint to solve this question. If you use logic gates, you are trapped. Okay, don't use logic gates. And please pause the video. Please try before watching the solution. Please try. Okay, welcome back. I hope you have tried and given your best efforts to solve this question with minimum logic. So now I'm going to tell the solution to this question. If you observe this table, the solution is in front of you. So we have inputs A3, A2, A1 and A0 and output B3, B2, B1, B0, C3, C2, C1 and C0. So now let us look at output. If you see bit B3, it is always connected to ground irrespective of input. So we have C3, C1 are also connected to ground irrespective of input. So we have three output bits B3, C3 and C1 connected to ground. So that is one observation. So second observation is, if you look at B2, B1 and B0, so these three bits you can compare with the input A3, A2 and A1. So they are similar. We connect A3 to B2, A2 to B1 and A1 to B0. So we get first four bits of our output. So now we are remaining with C2 and C0. So C2 and C0 are toggling. 0, 1, 0, 1. So we have only one input left which is not connected that is A0. If you observe that, it is also toggling 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1. So all we need to do is take a wire, connect A0 with C2 and C0. So this is our circuit design 
for the question according to the requirement with minimum logic. So this is a unique design because normally we will see logic gates and other combinational or sequential blocks inside the design. But here we are using only wires to connect inputs and outputs. So this is a different way of designing a circuit. So if you like this video, please make sure you smash that like button because YouTube is hungry for likes. Thanks for watching. Hope you and your family are having a great health and be brave.